Hello guys, welcome back to another course. So in this course, we'll be learning going over SQL and data analysis using SQL. So before we even begin, uh, let's go about why data is so important. Why are all these big, big tech companies such as Google, Facebook, why are all these even hackers included? Why, why is everyone after your data? Why is data so valuable? The simple answer is data is simply the new gold of this era, modern age. Okay, so with data, we can gain understanding of different concepts, uh, derive insights from data. We can gain credibility using data and generate different statistics. We can also, a lot of companies make a ton of money from data. So data is simply the new gold of, uh, of the current century. So uh, the data can help companies to make better decisions, generating sales reports, uh, employee turnovers, uh, best performing markets and stuff like that. And a lot of data is generated every minute and every second. So for example, there are 6,000 tweets generated per second, just in every second, right? That's a lot of uh, tweets per second. There are over 50,000, about 50,000 videos watched on YouTube. There are over 1.1 million uh, chats on, on WhatsApp per second. And there's over 2 million uh, snaps being sent over Snapchat every minute as we speak. So that's a lot of data being generated. So how do we, how are we able to store this data? Well, we can store this data in different formats using a different uh, such as relational databases, which we'll be covering in this course. Uh, we can store them using non-relational uh, databases uh, like MongoDB and stuff like that. You can also use a file system to store your data, right? Uh, so what was this course mostly about? So the course mostly is going to be, we're going to be learning uh, SQL, which is just a language that we use to talk to databases. So let's say that you have access to a database. How are you able to talk to the database? Which scripts are you going to be right to generate different reports from the database? And that's why you, that's where SQL comes in. And SQL just uh, starts for query structured uh, language. And you're going to be covering specifically MySQL in this uh, course. And it's just a variation of the SQL. Okay. So this uh, course mostly is going to be project-based learning. So we'll be trying to solve a task and tr during, uh, tr trying to solve the task, we'll learn different concepts and different uh, the techniques that will enable us to solve the task. And uh, finally, but not the least, we'll be uh, learning how to export data to Python. So we'll generate reports from SQL and then export the data from a CSV file into Python. And then we'll be able to do data visualization from Python. So uh, if you're wanting to be a data analyst, then this course is perfect for you. So looking at the salaries of data uh, analysts, so from Google, you can do a data analyst receives around almost a almost $100,000 per year. Uh, Netflix is about $112,000 per year. And then from Apple is about uh, also about $100,000 per year. So if you want to be a data analyst, then this course is perfect for you. It's not only just aimed at data analysts, even if you're just wanting to learn about databases, how to create database, how to generate reports, then this course is perfect for you. Uh, talking about the skills you need to learn to become a data analyst. Okay, this so this list of uh, of skills, I got this from datacourse.io. So you need to learn Python programming. Okay, so you need to learn Python programming. You need to, uh, if you are new to Python programming, I have a whole course on Python programming from absolute beginner to uh, advanced level. Uh, uh, so you need Python programming knowledge. You also need to learn SQL, which you're going to be covering in this tutorial. You're going to be learning specifically MySQL. Okay. And then also you need to have data visualization skills. So if you have these three skills of programming skills with Python or any like or another language like Julia, you need so you need to have uh, a skills, uh, skills which you're going to be covering in this course. You also need to have data visualization skills using uh, something like Power BI, uh, Tableau, or even Python, right, to generate simple graphs and data. To be able to do it, to be able to explain uh or to, to story tell data uh to story to story tell using data right so uh, what to be covered in this course so we'll be learning the basics of sql how to retrieve data from databases writing different concepts like group by uh, order by and stuff like that then we'll move on to database design how was the primary key what's the need uh data integrity data duplication we'll cover all those concepts and if I move on to the advanced, more advanced concept, we learn about or how, to, how functions work in MySQL, how to store procedures work, uh, how to generate views, how to generate temporary tables and CTEs and stuff like that. And then finally, we'll move on to data visualization in Python, where we analyze the data from SQL and then import the, uh, export the results in the form of a CSV file into, uh, yeah, into a CSV file, which you can then import into Python. And then I'll show you how to draw different graphs. Okay. So you don't have to be a Python, uh, you don't have to know Python or be a Python expert to follow along. Uh, if you want to learn Python, again, I have a, a course on introduction to Python on the channel page, so you can check that out. Yeah, so at the end, one additional, which is optional, I might not include it in the course or I might include it in the course. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. So 
um this is basically about like we'll take some go and f- ahead and find some interview questions and try to solve those interview questions in case so maybe any of you is applying uh any of you guys is trying to get a job or anything we'll pick some interview questions and try to solve them together okay so that's basically what the course is about and if you're new to the channel and you uh consider want to follow along with this course consider subscribing liking the video and sharing this uh content with anyone who you think might find it helpful